Hey guys, welcome to the channel today. Today we're going to be using this product right here, Protect All. You can pick this up at Walmart for like 10 bucks. This will be in the RV section. And this was uh, brought up in the comments from one of our uh, friends on, on YouTube here, K9 Kevin. I'll have his link below. He's a professional detailer. He has his own shop and he uses products like that. He recommended it. And he does have YouTube videos. So I'll have his link below and you guys can check him out. And this right here, basically, it says it polishes, waxes, and treats and protects. And then pretty much it says you can use it to clean plastic, glass, plexiglass, mirrors, and polishes the chrome, aluminum, and stainless steel. And it says it waxes clear coat, paint, fiberglass, and gel coat. Um, it treats vinyl, rubber, and finished leather. And it does have a UV blocker on it. It says right here for um, do it yourself. And it says you can use this on cars, trucks, RVs, motorcycle, boats, and ATVs, snowmobiles, and more. Now, uh, this would probably be good for boats, uh, vinyl on your uh, seats. Um, and for your motorcycles, stuff like that. It basically says it gives a showroom shine, not abrasive formulas, idea for hundreds of service, services, including clear coats. So, sounds like basically you can use this on anything. You probably put this on your dash. Um, your vinyl, everything. Um, probably does pretty good on your dash and stuff in the interior. Especially on this truck. It has a lot of um, big plastic and this and that on there. Be nice. Um, let's see. It says it leaves no white power re residue. And another thing it says too, if you wipe it in, if you do get streaks, just wipe, uh, spray some more of the product on there. And the st streaks are supposed to uh, go away. And it says apply at temperatures of 60 degrees and above 15 celsius and then shake do not leave uh keep from freezing too i noticed too on this one right here jackson michigan that's pretty cool i don't know if this stuff is made in michigan and that'd be cool if it does or the company that does it uv blocker another thing too you can pick up well you have to order this you can even get it in a a spray can I from Amazon I'll have the links below on Amazon this you the, uh, Walmart did not have it sorry about the wind guys it's it's real it's real windy today I'm trying to stand by the garage and that and and not have that wind but right there same thing but you get an aerosol can small can I think it's around the same price I'll have the link below because you can get both products Amazon if you like or if you uh, like to try them out at uh, and pick it up at Walmart up to you all right, we'll get going. I'm gonna we'll spray it on. It's right now. It's it's about 60. The wind's out, so we're not. Even though we're in the sun, the vehicle's in the sun. It's not. Uh, it's not warm at all. It's just a little warm to paint. That's it. I mean, it's not hot today at all. It would be a little bit warmer if the this breeze wasn't out. He's uh the kids in there. He's cleaning the truck inside. He washed it, and we'll uh. We'll try this stuff out and see how it looks. I don't know how long it's going to last. It's pretty much, you know, like a canoe wax. is roughly probably a month. But uh, it's something you can use once a month for at that price. Not bad. And you can use it on everything. Okay, as always, we're going to want to shake this up pretty good. Right now, we've been having the same thing. Two coats of that uh, hydro wax on this thing. That's what's on it now. It's been, man, we, we only put two applications on it. It's, it's September right now. What has it been, about five months maybe? Somewhere around there, we haven't put an application on it in a while. It's still making it look good. But, uh, probably get the... This lasts pretty good on this. Because it's not getting really exposed to that uh, environment. All right, let's try it out. We're going to spray it on. And we'll try out the other can. Shake it up real good. There you go. Ooh, it's thick too. I oh, I shook it up enough. This spray's pretty thick. I'll keep shaking that in a minute and we'll see. I think I used too much. So I'm gonna wipe it in like a wax. Man, it goes on nice and smooth. It over and we'll buff it out. Oh, yeah, it comes right off. I don't 
don't see too much streaking. Maybe a little cooler out or humid. Oh yeah, look at that. It came on, and went on and off at ease. Check it out. Let me shake this up a little bit better and see how it's raised. You can put it on the plastic. Yeah, plastic, everything. Windows, you name it. Nope, still coming out thick. Which is fine. At least you can see it. I like that too. You're able to see the product when you can spread it in there. But it spreads it nice. streaking here we're gonna buff it off it's gone like that. that's a nice product you pick up at uh walmart thanks k and kevin for uh for bringing this up in the comments to try this product out thanks that's a pretty good product look at that that's nice what if we should do a water test after we apply it we could we'll do it on the hood just have to redry it all right, let me get this side done, and the other side we'll try it out with the uh, with the spray can. Made that plastic look nice. Yeah, it's looking good. It smells like lemons. That's what it smells like to me. Should try it on this vinyl cover. What do you guys think? Sorry about that, son. So far, very easy to use. Yeah, that's nice. Get another towel. Kind of have it on a plastic. If you guys can see the difference, right there. Kind of shines it up a little bit. Of it's gonna flash a little bit. It's not bad on the plastic. If you guys can see that. All right, let's get a. We're gonna test out the. Uh, aerosol can we'll do the hood and leave the front right here with that let's go get it all right we've got the aerosol can shake it up real good notice too this does not give any residue at all that's what's is nice goes on pretty good all right let's try out the can oh yeah i like the can probably be good to get in there those areas check it out oh yeah works pretty good I might have used too much but it goes on nice get in there plastic I'm gonna grant I'm gonna have to get in there with a sponge get another microfiber towel to get in there real good I hate these louvers to clean <laughs> put it on the windows We'll just have to do our best to get in there. Man, it makes the glass nice. It really does. That was a little bit too much. I'm gonna get this plastic. And take another towel and we'll buff it off. Oh yeah, this stuff comes off nice. Look at that. Good product. All right, let's try it out on the chrome right, right here. And the plastic, and I'll finish up. And then we'll look at the final results. Check it out. Check it out. Yeah, it's nice, dude. You guys, this is all. Look at that plastic. Wow. That's pretty cool. I'm going to do all this too. Check that out. I gotta buff it out. Easy to come off. What's nice too, this is another product you don't have to order. If you want to order at Amazon, it helps out using the link. It helps us out a little bit, up to you. But you can pick this up at Walmart. Look at that plastic. Look at that results. Got some spray on here, but 
give you guys a little bit of results on that. Wow. Check that out. That's just faded. That needs to be repainted. Did a good job on that chrome. That's going to look nice. So, yeah, you can pretty much use it on everything. All right, let's finish up, and then we'll check out the rest of the results. It's all faded too. I'll hit it. Last. Got I got dog barking. What are you doing? Probably tell me. Hurry up. Uh, I think the wife wants me to wash her Jeep too. She gets home from work. Right? What are you guys doing, huh? What's up? Where's the other one? Still eating? All right, let's get this done. Okay, we can see the difference right there. What it's doing to the plastic, shining up. Granted, I don't think it's gonna last forever, but it does make it look good. It's gonna give it some protection. So, all right, we'll keep going. Almost done, guys, almost done, and we'll do the end. Real quick, also, we did put the protect all uh, on the tunnel cover. It came out pretty good. We'll see how if it protects. I do have another product I like to make a video on putting on a tunnel cover. But it came out pretty decent. I, um, I think it would have been better if I would have did a better job cleaning it. My fault. It's hard to get in these cracks. Just got to get there and scrub a little bit more. But uh, other than that, it's looking good. Back window's done. You're gonna throw this in there before we do the ending. Man, look how beautiful it is. We got done about an hour ago. We're losing our light, but just bringing it up real quick on the faded plastic right here on the bottom. It does come pretty much kind of come back where it's faded. You can see, figure bring that up, but it does look clean. And then, you know, to fix that the right way would be just to repaint it with the plastic paint. You could tape it up and clean it real good and paint it. But I'll figure bring that up so we show you guys everything the best we can to uh, show how the product works. But it does look clean. Um, so that's a plus. It doesn't really look too bad. So it just come back a little bit. A couple spots. But, but the plus thing that it does work clean. And look how shiny it is. Man, that stuff looks nice. All right, guys, gals, we're all done. Getting it done. Look at that. It looks pretty good. I got a couple spots that streaked. I got to wipe up real quick. None of that. That's done. What do you think of it? Look good? Yeah, guys, come out, comment below. Have you ever tried it? It's nice, too. You can pick this up at your local store. Again, I want to thank Kion, Kion Kevin for bringing this up about checking out this product hey man it works out good i don't know if i want to do a water test i don't know so we got another towel out all right we'll just do a little little water test so we can dry it he wants to go run to the store in his truck since we got all cleaned up so all right let's just check it out real quick we'll just do it on this I don't want to dry the whole hood off. Check that out. Runs off pretty good. That looks good, guys. It's nice. Got some nice beading. A little bit of sheeting. Looks good. Still a fast one. That beaded on the plastic, too. 
Oh, she trade off. Look at that. If you do miss, you're not going to get that sheeting effect. But look at that. That she trade off, guys. All right, that's it. So I got to dry it off, and he can have his truck back. We got to put some tire dressing on there and call it good. So, guys, yeah, thanks for watching this video. I appreciate it. Without you guys, there won't be no channel. Now, hey, one thing, too. You notice that when you clean your car and you go for a ride, don't it feel like it just drives better, feels better, runs better? <laughs> Let me know in the below, guys and gals. You guys have a great day. Later. Is it clean? Yep.